Hey guys, me again. Um, if you guys saw my video explaining why I'm moving to Texas, I filmed it in this exact space two seconds ago with the same look. So I'll have that video linked down below if you guys haven't seen it already. I am moving to Texas, keeping my place in LA. Um, long story short, uh, Texas is gonna be home base. I felt like that was just like where I'm supposed to be right now. I'm gonna keep my place in LA. I'm always gonna work here. I love LA so freaking much. And yeah, that is the life update that a lot of you guys already kind of figured out. But today's video is going to be the empty tour of my house in Dallas. I filmed this with other people in the house and sometimes I just get like kind of awkward and like weird, like quiet. I don't know if it's like someone I don't know well who's around when I'm filming. So I feel like I seem like a little bit, I don't know, I was like a little bit off this day, honestly, but I just wanted to come in and give you guys an intro and say like the real reason I think I was acting off is because someone else is in the house that like, I feel like when other people are in the house and I just get like quiet and weird and whatever. But I am so freaking happy about this house. We bought it. Um, I'm like renting to buy it from my dad, but I'm, ha I'm making all the payments and stuff. So that will be that um but i am so freaking grateful and i just love you guys so much thank you guys so much like even like besides the like obvious like being able to like buy and stuff um you guys literally make my life amazing like i would not be able to just be like you know what i think like basically god's calling me to dallas and like just to be able to like get up and move essentially like i don't have to like find a new job and quit here and put on my two like you know what i'm saying like Thank you guys so much. This is seriously like dream life, dream job, dream everything. And I'm really, really grateful for you guys. Like this stuff, none of this would happen without you guys, literally at all. So thank you guys. I love you so much. If you guys are new here, be sure to subscribe. Also, there's a lock around Instagram. Also, I have to completely furnish this place. I already have the vibe and the look that I want. As of right now, I've only ordered two chairs for the entire house, but uh, I'm about to order my couch. And a table from CB2. I need to get a call. Literally, I need, let's be real. I have to get everything. So, it's going to be quite the experience. I have, I really was going over how much money I'm about to spend in the past, in the next few weeks. And like, oh, it's a literally, it could be a salary at this point. Not really. But like, oh my gosh. Moving is no joke. Like, at all. Especially when you have to like buy furniture again. Because I've been moving here. But I haven't like always had to buy new furniture. And even without buying new furniture, it's so expensive. So that is what is happening. It's probably gonna be a little process because I'll do like the downstairs and I'll do the upstairs. I'm not like necessarily rushing to get everything done immediately because I don't want it to like not be something that I love. But with that being said, I need to be able to, you know, live and have a place to sit in my house. So that is what we're doing. I'm mostly excited for my bathtub with jets. Oh my gosh, guys, this house in LA, like, we do have a bathtub, but our house is so old that it's just, like, gross and, like, messed up. We don't even touch the bathtub. So, one, so excited to have a bathtub again. Not one, but two, and the master one has jets. So, I'm very excited. But I just wanted to say thank you guys again. Seriously, so freaking much for just, like, following me and just, like, being around. Like, even just, like, comments and, like, I've been meeting so many of you guys just around. Like, literally, I've been running into you guys as you're listening to my podcast, which is, like, so crazy. But that being said, I know you guys just want to watch the haul, not the haul, the tour. But I love you guys. If you want to hear more about the story of moving, it's for sure a ramble, but I'm kind of just talking to you guys as, like, friends. Um, I will have that video linked down below. But I love you guys so much. Get ready for moving vlogs. Comment down below if you guys have any recs for Dallas, like, literally everything. Like, I need, like, restaurant recs. I mean, I'm from there. Like, I know a lot. But, like, restaurant recs, coffee shops, where should I get my nails done? Where should I go work out? Where should I? You know what I'm saying? I need recs for every single thing that you guys can think of. So, leave them down below. And then if you guys are not from Texas, comment down below where you guys are from. Love you guys so much. And I will see you guys soon but let's get started with the tour yeah hey guys welcome to my dallas house tour um so by this point you guys will have already heard me talk about this i'm very excited um so we got a place i got a place in dallas which is very 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 exciting um you guys are seeing it before all of this stuff gets changed like we're painting all the walls white we're like redoing the kitchen and then i'll be broke for a little bit and then later on we're gonna pick up and add some more stuff so you guys are in the entry um it is technically i mean really it's four stories but it's like mainly two you guys will see what i mean but you guys walk in here 
Um, and then over here, I have this garage. Ooh, where are the lights? Okay. I feel like I'm a very real adult because I have a garage. My washer and dryer will go in here. Um, yeah, I mean, it's not that exciting. Like, I don't really know. I thought about, like, making a gym down here. That would be fun. But, like, I guess I need to use it for my car. So, we go upstairs. There you go up the stairs. It's currently staged right now. Um, but this will obviously, obviously, this will all be changed. All this will be white and it'll be so perfect. But this is the main like living area. This will be my couch. Like I want to get a fireplace. I don't know why I'm out of breath right now. <laughs> Over here, I'll eventually get a fireplace. I'm going to do kind of the same layout. I already have my couch picked out. I kind of have my coffee table picked out. The chairs that I sat in today that I really wanted were $1,300 each, so that's not happening. There's like a mini balcony out here. Here is the little like kitchen breakfast nook thing. I also have the table picked out for this. It's kind of weird because there's no like, like the light is in such an awkward place. So I don't know what I'm gonna do about that. I have the vibe that I want pretty much down. Then we go over to the kitchen. I'm really excited to go back to having one of these things. That will be very exciting. Um, eventually, I will replace the countertop. That's not like the first thing I'm gonna do. The first thing I'm gonna do, paint the walls white. Um, I'm gonna get the cabinets and the backsplash all white. I need to get like knob things. Why am I forgetting what these are called? No, they'd be knobs. Handles. Cabinet knobs, cabinet handles. Whatever, I need to get those. Um, the fridge comes to the place. This is my first time opening it. Um, I'll eventually be replacing this just because it's gonna look a little bit weird with how I redo everything. Um, but yeah, we have the kitchen, everything here. And then you go over here and we have this little closet that is kind of like a little Harry Potter closet right here, as you guys can see. Oh, I really wanna watch Harry Potter tonight. But we're gonna like somehow, I keep saying we, it's just me. But I just mean, I say we for everything. I've noticed that in this move. Um, I'm going to somehow, I don't know, fill out a pantry in here. And then we just have a little pasta room. So it's a two bed, two and a half bath. So we have like all this and yeah, it's just really gonna be so nice. Ah! Okay. Um, we can go upstairs. Okay, so up on this floor, this is where the bedrooms are. This right here will be my bedroom. Um, I'll also replace that. There's a lot of things, obviously you guys catch the gym at this point, I'm replacing a lot of things. My bedroom, I have no idea what I even want it to look like. I guess definitely a dresser there would make sense. I want to mount a TV here. That's all I got. So, anyways, moving over here, we have my bathroom. Okay, so there's two things, a bathtub with jets. Oh my gosh, I just realized that. It's dirty, they need to like clean up, but oh my gosh. <gasps> Oops, no, oh, scary. Wow. But we also have a shower, as you guys can see. Um, so that's pretty cool. Walking in here, this is my closet. We've got a like, pretty good size walk-in closet. This is kind of odd over here. That they have this, but then to here, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. I'm trying to like get rid of a lot of things and keep just a lot less stuff because I don't need it. This is pretty cool though. Like it's already built-in shelves, so that'll be convenient. Um, probably for shoes, I'm assuming, because I don't really have anywhere else to put them. So the nice thing though is because I have that huge garage, all of my like suitcases and everything don't have to stay in my closet. Okay, so then out here we have a balcony. We'll be coming back here because there's a whole rooftop. Over here um, we have another bathroom. This is really nice because I really do strongly believe that like Sharing bathrooms with people is actually okay, except for my roommate now, she's great. But like when Quentin is using the bathroom and I use the bathroom, it like literally makes me want to scream. So, anyways, um, <laughs> really easy, you know. Um, another bathroom, this is just a bathtub and shower, very nice. Then moving over here, this will be my office. 
Um, it's pretty small, honestly. So, like, I just, I don't even honestly know if I could do, like, basically all I could do would be a desk. Like, I want a desk, like, in the middle. You know what I might do is the shelves that way and the desk this way. Because it's facing the window and the lighting will be better. Yeah, that's what I'll do. That's better. Okay, and then there's another closet here. Um, not really sure what I'll put in there. Maybe, like, outerwear and stuff. And then we will go up to the rooftop, which is my favorite part of the house. Um, there's a big balcony outside of my room. And then you take the spiral staircase. And then you get to the balcony, so I'll see you guys up there. So as you guys can see, it's a very large, great good sized balcony. And then there's a spiral staircase that goes up to my beautiful rooftop. Okay, so here's the rooftop. It is actually so big. Like seriously so nice. There's a view of the city kind of like, as you guys can see, uh, it's a little bit blocked off, but it is just so beautiful. Whoa, you know what I thought about? These are gonna cause some issues, but anyways. <sighs> so my vision for out here is it's gonna be the coolest rooftop in all of Texas. I'm gonna get turf everywhere. Eventually I'm gonna buy like a whole outdoor seating area and then I wanna get a grill. Did I get a grill up here? Yeah, there's an outlet over here, but it has to be through here. And then I also want, I don't know how, that's really unfortunate that that's not cute, um, but I want like a whole like table. You guys know that I like love doing family dinners with all my friends. So that will be crazy this summer, but that's gonna take some time because that's very expensive. So yeah, I love the rooftop. I feel like I'm gonna spend so much time up here. Once it is done, I'm very excited. So that is it for the tour. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm very excited. Um, there's gonna be a ton of like moving vlogs. A lot of like home update first and then moving. I'm so freaking excited. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I love you guys so much and I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.